This is a quick tutorial on using the Evoc 20 PS in Logic Pro 10. I'll break it down into three simple steps. Setting up the vocoder, setting up an audio track, and finally tracking and mixing the vocoder. This is an example of using the clear voice vocoder preset with a pre-recorded MIDI track. Okay, so here we go. Create a new software instrument track and select the vocoder patch. You could also use the library and save your own custom patch if you choose to. We're going to need a bus for input into the sidechain for the vocoder. So select an audio track and add a bus send to that audio track. I think it works best to make this send a pre-fader send, and don't forget to set a level. Now set the sidechain to the bus and choose a vocoder preset. The vocoder is now ready to use. Let me show you one way to use it. Copy a pre-recorded MIDI track into the vocoder software instrument. Now review your settings in the mixer. Pay particular attention to send levels and outputs. For this particular use, I want to have a blend between the vocoder and the actual audio track, so I'll leave the stereo output on. You have to make sure that you turned off the output for the auxiliary channel that was created for the bus that we used for side chaining. Set up the vocoder and you're ready to record. After tracking the audio, you'll be able to adjust the levels uh, of the audio side chain, of the vocoder output, and pretty much all of the other settings of the vocoder. Okay, so here we go. There's just one girl I call my sweetheart Or just one girl I'd buy the ring This is just one way to use the vocoder, but the basic setup is the same. Use the sidechain, bust from an audio track, and have fun.